With the restructuring of the National League divisions to 10 team leagues next season, it's meant a brutal culling of clubs from National League 2, of five getting relegated. And in the last day of the season for both Berwick and Preston Lodge, it was a case of the winners staying up and the losers going down. That made things very tense and a crowd of well over a thousand turned up at Penny Pit Park to watch the drama unfold. Berwick got off the marks first with a try from Aidan Rosie, who's been prolific all season, and that settled the Berwick nerves. But two tries from the home side from Finlay Hughes and then Scott Clark put them into the lead. An interception try for Berwick's James Thompson put Berwick back in the lead at the break and that inspired them to better things in the second half. A clever chip from Jack Webster to Rory Hindhaugh set up James Greave to go over for a third try. And then Aidan Rosie put the match beyond doubt when he ran in for his brace towards the end, giving Berwick a 31-10 victory and confirming their National 2 status next season. It was also round six in the Kings of the Sevens at Langham, and we had an all-border final with Jed Forrest and Kelso going head-to-head. Jed started off the better with this try from Kieran Hayes, but Kelso responded with three tries of their own, including this from Murray Woodcock. Jed got a consolation try back from Lewis Young, but it was Kelso who landed the spoils by 17 points to 14, just a week after winning promotion to the Premiership. Stuart Cameron, ITV News.